1 Chronicles chapter 14 King Hiram of Tyre sent messengers to David, along with cedar timber, masons, and carpenters to build a house for him. David recognized that the Lord had firmly established him as king over Israel, as his kingdom prospered greatly because of his people. In Jerusalem, David took more wives and had more sons and daughters. Here are the names of his children born in Jerusalem, Shamua, Shobab, Nathan, Solomon, Ibhar, Elishua, Elpalet, Noga, Nepheg, Japhia, Elishama, Biliada, Eliphalet. When the Philistines heard that David had been anointed king over all Israel, they gathered to seek David. David heard of their gathering and went out to confront them. The Philistines assembled in the valley of Rephaim. David inquired of God, asking, Should I go up against the Philistines? Will you deliver them into my hand? The Lord answered him, Go up, for I will indeed deliver them into your hand. So David went up to Balperazim and defeated the Philistines there. David declared, God has broken through my enemies by my hand, like the breaking forth of waters. Therefore, they named that place Balperazim. Afterward, when the Philistines left their idols there, David gave orders to burn them with fire. The Philistines once again spread out in the valley. David inquired of God once more, and God said to him, Do not go up after them, turn away from them and come upon them opposite the mulberry trees. When you hear the sound of marching in the tops of the mulberry trees, then go out to battle, for God has gone out before you to strike the Philistine army. David followed God's command, and they defeated the Philistine army from Gibeon to Gezer. David's fame spread throughout all lands, and the Lord instilled fear of him among all nations.